Hi, Jason here. All right. So today we'll be doing an unboxing of the Seagate Iron Wolf 125 SSD. All right. As we know that this is an SSD that is specially made for NAS, and I'm sure every all of you are curious as to what could be inside the content and what are the things that we should keep a lookout for. All right. First and foremost, when you are purchasing an SSD, make sure that you understand the warranty that is provided by the manufacturers. Okay. So for this particular NAS SSD that is from Seagate Technologies, all right, they are giving you five years of hardware warranty and with three years of rescue plan recovery. All right. So that's very, very important as I believe they are one of the few and very, very rare that gives you three years of data recovery plan in case anything happens to the device. All right. So let's move on and see what we can see inside this device, inside this package. All right. So now, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to cut open. All right, make sure that when you get the device, it is sealed. All right, and it's brand new. Okay, so we're going to do a quick cut open. Okay, and so right now it's open up. I'm going to open up the unit. Okay, and let's pull out what's inside. Okay, so you can see here it's sealed in a static, any static bag. All right, and on top of that, you have the warranty instructions and also the rescue plan booklet all right so very importantly let's go through the rescue plan booklet all right so you've got to make sure that all right you have to submit and in case if you want to go through any of it go to the website www.seagate.com rescue plan all right and register and basically you will go through the steps with you should you have any issues all right so now be sure that you are using this as your main storage, only you use the rescue plan. If you are using it as your cache, all right, there's no point going through the, the rescue plan, all right, because it's just for cash writing. Right. So the next one we're going to look into is this is the empty static bag. It's very well packed and very well sealed. All right. So you will know that it's brand new. Okay. So as usual, okay, we're gonna tear it up and open it. Okay. Okay. And we're going to take the unit out and you can see the symbol and logo is very, very well done. Okay, you can see here it's Iron Wolf meant for Nash. Now, the thing is, this is a 7mm SSD, right? So, should you want to use this for any of your media application, let's just say that you know that because you're using it for a lot of read write, okay, you can also install in any of your media systems, all right? Because we know that this is a very tough and efficient um, endurance ready. SSD. Okay, so now as usual, the minimum starting point for the NAS SSD starts from 250 GB upwards to 4 TB. Okay, so as usual with SSD, do take note that all right, the larger the capacity, the faster the read write speed will be. All right, so in order to do that, what you're going to do is when you purchase an SSD, all right, read through the content. Okay, you will see it here. All right what is encompassed in the warranty and how long it can last, especially in terms of the rewrite and also to make sure that you know what kind of material is being used. Okay, In the case of the Seagate Iron Wolf NAS SSD, it's using TLC technology. Okay, So for today, I'm not going to go into the various different technology in SSDs, but you will know that this is using TLC. All right, So you'll know how long it will last for you in your case of your usage. Right. So, now, as usual, okay, I'm going back into what I mentioned earlier, all right, remember, make sure that you, when you're using an SSD that is meant either for your main storage or for your caching purposes, to make sure that you are buying and using a high endurance SSD, be it for M.2 or 2.5 inch, okay, and you know that if you're using the Seagate SSD together with the Synology NAS, you will have your, you will have your, application where you can see in your NAS apps, all right, the health and notification in case anything happens, all right. So other than that, should you have any issues, please remember to like our video, subscribe to our channel, and if you have any comments, please feel free to write them and we will definitely give you a reply, all right. Thank you very much for enjoying our unboxing today.